In today's video, I will talk about how to use the A10 Mini as a webcam for your Google Meet meetings. And what are the advantages of using an A10 Mini setup for your video conference calls? Using the A10 Mini as a webcam will improve your video quality. And if you are the boss of your company, of course, you have to look good for your meetings, right? Also, I will be sharing tips along the way and give my real life experiences. So do stay tuned as I share them with you. Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Steph. I run a production house here in Singapore, doing photography, videography, live stream, and basically everything tech. Welcome to my channel. I'm sure many of you who get on video conference meeting calls are pretty unsatisfied with your computer or laptop's building camera and how pixelated you look to your colleagues. For myself, my laptop is pretty much connected to my A10 Mini Extreme in my home studio. So you can see from this diagram that I've drawn out, my laptop is on my table with my A10 Mini Extreme by my side on my right. Then my laptop is in the middle connected to my A10 Mini using a USB-C cable from my laptop to the USB port on the A10 Mini. My camera is connected to the A10 Mini through one of the HDMI ports and placed just right above my laptop so I can look into the camera while talking and also refer to any notes on my laptop. Then I have a small USB microphone connected to the Mic 1 port of the A10 so I have good audio quality when I talk. So how do you do this? In your Google Meet layout, click on the three dots for more options. Then click on settings. Under audio, click on the drop down button under microphone and you should be able to see the A10 mini option. Select that. Then go to the video option. Click on the drop down button under camera and you should be able to see the option of selecting your A10 mini. Instantly, you can see a huge difference between using the building camera of my laptop versus the camera connected to my A10 mini. Also, let me show you the difference in audio quality when using the laptop's microphone versus the attached USB microphone connected to the A10 mini. Hi, this is using the onboard microphone from my laptop. Hi, this is using the dedicated USB microphone which is connected to my A10 mini on my laptop. So there you have it, how to use the A10 mini setup for your Google Meet meetings and the advantages in using this setup. After watching this video, you guys can take what resonates and leave what doesn't behind. At the end of the day, I just hope you learned something, anything from today's video. I hope you found this video useful and if you like more of such videos, let me know in the comments below what you would like to see in the future. Before you go, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a like. That would mean so much to me. And as always, I'm Steph. If you have any questions, please let me know.